I want to also bring it to a little bit more of a of a of a um, intimate subject. Not only are we talking about the chemicals that you use for your um, daily hygiene, I want to talk about the things that you put in there. Period. Everything that you would introduce into your yoni needs to be completely cleansed and prepared, and done in a mindful way. So we're talking about your lovers, your toys your um, tampons, suppositories, everything needs to be completely gentle, sensitive, and sanitized. Um, yeah, all the way, all of them, all, everything, everything, everything at all times, just like as if it were to be going in your eye, okay? And that, um, that kind of hygiene before and after intimacy is incredibly important. I'm sure everybody knows that. Um, but I just wanted to re reiterate that there because sometimes it, um, I'm hearing from a lot of women also issues that come from the partner and the partner's hygiene practices. Okay, so um, the other thing that I want to talk about while we're in the subject of intimacy is the practice of loving head down. Because when we love um, down up and getting to know somebody, well, this culture, it's kind of popular in our culture right now that we would love someone getting to know each other with our intimacy intimate physical parts first and then see how we work out with our minds and our hearts in order. And that actually um, puts a strain and a filter, um, a, strain, a need to filter on the yoni, giving the yoni a job that it really doesn't have. It doesn't need to be filtering. It's not a discernment portal for you. It The mind should be that because once the yoni has been um, accessed by something that is of lower integrity, it's too delicate. Use the mind to filter, not the reactions of the yoni, because she will react and let you know when it's the wrong person, even if it has nothing to do with hygiene, if it's not a harmonic um, building with the person, she gonna react in ways that might look like it's hygiene but it's not, right? So that's just another thing while we're on the subject of intimacy. Make sure that we're loving head down, getting to know our, our partners and um, connecting with our hearts before we introduce the physicality of our intimacy will make a huge difference in our culture, in our families, and the health of our yonis. 